Welcome back to my Let's Play for Pokemon Heart Gold, my mono electric run. It's time to take on Bugsy. You also have to see if he can really bug me this episode, right? Of course, this change to the gym is a bit gimmicky, but, you know, whatever works for you, I suppose. Okay. Big up your sleeve, man. Ah, that's a pretty classic line. I do have to ask, why would you want Pokemon to evolve really fast? That means they can't keep up later on down the road, because they evolve so early. It's a real downside to bug Pokemon, you know? Just something always keep in the back of your mind whenever you're using them. You want to get stuff like Heracross or Scyther. The ones that don't evolve are actually usually better than the ones that do evolve. At least in the early generations. That's why Pinsir, Scyther are usually your go-to Pokemon. And Generation 1 if you want to be a bug trainer. And Butterfree. But that's because of Sleep Powder, so you got status effects going on there. Beedrill doesn't even qualify for the list. Even with Twin Needle, I still wouldn't use it. Of course it didn't work. Damn, that hurt. I've had worse, but that definitely stung. I got all my way to paralyze it and it doesn't look like it's going to kick in. Once. Oh, finally! When the fight's basically over. If I just went straight on the offensive, I would have taken just as much damage as if I hadn't done that at all. <sighs> I effectively wasted my time. Suppose it's not. Whatever. Okay. Yeah, yeah I am. So it's gonna be a double battle or each one's just gonna send out one Pokemon apiece. Double battle, got it. Thundershock. Get rid of label off first. It knows um supersonic. So I'd rather just eliminate it. Sure, I might get poisoned by Spinarak, but I'm carrying around five antidotes. So you know what? Being poisoned, not such a big deal right now. I'm bit surprised it just doesn't automatically select Spinarak for me, considering it's the only target available right now. Oh, that was easy. Mimi? Trying to get me Digimon flashbacks? Interesting. Okay. Yep, I'm eager for battle two. Since my opponent's defeat is nigh. Well, good thing this isn't a bug on bug battle then. This is an electric on bug battle, and I think I have the advantage. But come on. Try and show us you got Bugsy. Ah, starting out with the best. Not a bad policy, I suppose. Ah, switching out into Metapod. Gotcha. Why does he have a level 15 Metapod? Who does that? No. I'm guessing he's gonna do another U-turn on my face. So I'm countering him with a Super Potion. Sure, I'll take a ton of damage, but you know what? I'll deal with it. Oh, he actually didn't switch out. Interesting. <laughs> I doubt that's gonna work in my favor. It never seems to. <sighs> Caught 
called it. Another super potion. Wish I could find some of those citrus berries, man. Well, at least I wasn't the only one with that idea. <sighs> oh, nice. But, gosh darn it, it's quick attacks hurting a lot. I guess he was going to go for Slash or something that time. Whatever it was, it wasn't a priority move, I can tell you that much. <sighs> and that leaves Kakuna. He must be kicking himself right now. <laughs> it doesn't matter how tough it is, it's a Kakuna. It's not worth Jack squat. I don't even care if it knows Poison Sting. It's still not worth anything. It's not going to hang in there long enough to matter. Now I guess it's my Thunder Shock attack. <sighs> yeah, it was. And like always, his Scyther is the most fearsome Pokemon on his team. I didn't even think of, think of U-Turn. <laughs> First time I've ever even seen that tactic before. <laughs> I've heard of it. I didn't know that's something he could actually do to you. <sighs> well, at least we didn't get knocked out, I suppose. That's cool. Is it still Fury Cutter? Oh, it's U turn. That's his new gimmick move, huh? I suppose. To a certain extent. Here we go. So if I'd switched the blue one back, I could have gotten over two. Darn it. Like I said, I hate these things. Maybe I should just use my escape rope and something it works. Okay, let's do this. If I'd done that blue one earlier, I would have been better off. Of course, I need to go heal up now, too. Well, no. Let's get out of here. Ow. Come on. Yep, I want to have my Pokemon restored. So they're fighting fit. There's one other thing I'd like to take care of tonight, and that's the rival battle. <sighs> Which may be a lot tougher than I think it's gonna be, you know? Depends on how high level his Pokemon are. Yeah, I thought so. No way they get rid of this. Yep, I already beat them. Okay, let's do this. Okay, Croc. Show me what you got. Ghastly, huh? Well, now. You can't spite me until after I've used the move, you fool. Whatever. I wasn't planning on switching anyway. Ugh. Jeez. This guy's not very bright, is he? He wasted his first turn on Spite, which he couldn't even use. And then he used Mean Look, of all things. Why not Curse? Okay, it wasn't probably high enough level to know it yet, but still. Oh no, I'm slower than than the, my opponent. Whatever will I do? I'm surprised he didn't pick something else. Oh, that's right, his other Pokemon's Zubat. Which is gonna be no more helpful here. Dude, your performance so far has been pitiful, so... Watch your mouth. Tch. Oh, come on, you haven't even taken out my first Pokemon yet. You might get lucky now, though. 
in there between flinching or me beating myself in the submission. Nope, even with the help of confusion, you still weren't able to pull it off. Now oh, that's just sad, man. Okay. Maybe. What's this do exactly? Oh, but you basically can do that with Paralyze. It lowers the opponent's speed, so why would you want Cotton Spore? Yeah. I'm gonna keep Thunder Wave. I don't need Cotton Spore. Ugh, at least for now. Well, it's good to know you hate yourself. Maybe one of these days you'll get over your self-esteem issues, but for now, you can just go away. I probably will be, considering how weak you are. Uh, let's go hit up the Pokemon Center. I'm probably not gonna fight too many of the Pokemon in the forest, but... Uh, it'd be nice to be healed up. Hmm. I'm partially tempted to head over to Goldenrod right now, but I still have other stuff to record, so... I'm gonna be stopping here for tonight. Until next time, then. See ya!